We've got a guest in the Beko kitchen this morning. Welcome back, Annabelle! Oh, Mike, how mm. are you? Oh, good. We're good alone, to see you. We're alone together at last. We are alone which together. Which is fantastic. Now, listen, the food show. Yes. Can you stand the excitement? I, I mean, am. I'm excited. It's only a few more days. I can hardly sleep. And the great, <laughs> the great thing about it is that it brings together all these wonderful things. So today, instead of cooking, we're doing assemblage. Oh, good. Assemblage. I'm good assemblage. at assemblage. So we're taking products from the food show. Yes. We're going to make... What are we actually going to make? Well... Well, we're, assemble. <laughs> we're going to assemble dumpling soup oh. but it's very very delicious and we've got this lovely beautiful look you're going to have this beautiful bowl from Mud Australia we're well, there at the show as well they are going to be there and that is sensational we're going to fill it up with goodness for you isn't it beautiful it's so smooth, light too isn't smooth, it fabulous crazy yes. well lots to tell you about considering yes. what is coming up it is going to be a fun few days here in the Beko kitchen with Annabelle <laughs> looking forward to hearing more about the Auckland food show a little later on as well great to have you with us in the Beko kitchen and to have you back on the show Annabelle well, great to see you. Always fun. I know, it's always fun when you and I get together. And what have you been doing since last time we've seen you? Well, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. That's for you to wonder and for me to know. <laughs> <laughs> see, it's always trouble and it is always trouble. Well, all of this week we're really excited because we are featuring some of the amazing exhibitors that you'll be able to meet at the Auckland Food Show, which starts this Thursday at the ASB Showgrounds. And today, Annabelle, you're going to be showing us a recipe using House of Dumplings frozen dumplings, uh -huh. which is convenient. So as you said earlier, it's more assembling rather than cooking. It is. It's good news because, you, in actual fact, all the work is here. These are divine house of dumplings, mm. delicious dumplings, which you can, of course, go home, put them into a steamer or your oh. steamer and steam them. And from frozen, it takes about 10 minutes. Oh, we love that. And they're delicious. And they also, these gorgeous people, make mum sauce, which oh, you can use. Look at that. Or a little bit of chilli oil, which you can also use with your dumplings. But you know what? I sort of feel, Mike... You need a bit of building up. Okay. No, I think I think that maybe what we need to do yes. is take the same delicious dumplings. Yes. I've got to tell you a bit about these because they're very, very special. Yeah. But we're going to just put some broth there in the pot there, mm -hmm. which is just chicken stock. Yeah, easy. And we're going to throw these dumplings in, but we're going to do a little bit of work <gasps> with the veg. Okay, so, cool. Well, let's get chopping the okay. veg, and you tell me more I about the dumplings to, okay. as we go. Oh, yeah. I'm so glad you asked, Mike, because <laughs> Vicky, who is the... You think I'm trouble. You should meet the queen of dumplings. Vicky, the genius behind these wonderful things. In Hong Kong, when she was growing up, her mum used to make dumplings. No way. She, used to, she was a bit of an athlete, a bit like me, and she used to eat 30 of these dumplings <laughs> within her mother's kitchen. I so could she, do that. Yeah. So she <laughs> fell in love with the dumplings. I met her at the food show years ago, and she makes these things, but the great thing about them is it's no MSG, no junk, wow. nothing. Everything's wow. delicious, and she really cares about where the ingredients come from from these dumplings. Made but, with love is what so we she, like to so say. So she's watching us, we've got to make sure oh, we do a good cool. job no, with no. Okay. So we're, we're so going to take your dumplings and we're going to, we're going to put them on steroids, so to are. speak. We've okay, got cool. chicken broth in a pot. How simple is that? Mm. Now, M Mike, can you, can you, you slice? Chop? Yes, oh darling. God. Can you slice away? <laughs> okay, yes. cool. And you know what? It doesn't really matter how it is. And I'm just grating okay, a bit good. of carrot in here. Not that, I mean, there's lots of luscious ingredients in the dumplings, but I just thought a little bit of carrot into some chicken stock and we're going to add some bit of chili we've got that left over then we've got there and we're going to put some bok choy in there and we're making almost a meal in itself and that's all really good ingredients and fast ingredients as well exactly and you can just literally if you've got one carrot in the fridge you've got a few mushrooms you've got a chili you can put your own personality onto it but the great thing about it is her dumplings have got free-range pork they've got delicious oh, get chicken. out of here it really is. she has she really cares about where things come from well, and, and people ke I can put it in there I oh, good good it's so hard getting help these days <laughs> right and we're putting a bit of ginger in there as well. Okay, cool. Beautiful. So we've got. Taste. Do you want me to slice anything else? Oh yes, why not? Okay, good. Why not? Oh bok choy. Have, old bok choy. I have washed this beforehand, so don't worry. I'm not putting anything in there. Nice. I'm just going to do this. You like to slice that down there, darling. Okay, cool. With, with, there we are. Okay. You do that. Well, let me know if I'm doing it wrong. No, 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 no. I would never do that. No, you're doing a beautiful job. I thought you were going to say no, 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 no. no you're what fine. are you doing? You're fine. You're fine. And we can we can sort of just have those there because we're going to put the dumplings in now. Now all you've got. To do they come in these gorgeous wee box with this lovely little bit of soy sauce but oh. we don't need that okay we're going to throw these in here now you're yes. watching the frozen dumplings just go into the broth oh so how easy is and that and remember all the goodness is in those dumplings because they really care about where those ingredients come from all local 
and we might just hold off. You want to hold off on the we bok choy? We can just you? Hold, off, gonna... hold off on that, darling. <laughs> so we want that extra goodness and green. We can put that in the end because you can almost eat that raw. So that's going to take about a good sort of maybe eight minutes to cook away in there. And they're just going to flavour through. You've got the mushroom got there. You've got a little bit of ginger. And what about this? How about a little bit of heat? A you little bit of hotness in the yeah, kitchen. Yeah, come on there, Well, that happened come when on. you arrived. Now, now you want careful, me to slice it, careful. yes. Now, be very careful. Well, after, bits. You, after you slice the chilli, yes. you must wash your hands because uh, you, untoward oh, then... things happen if you don't um, because of the, what's on the chilli. Okay, and oh, you don't sweetheart. want to rub your eyes, no, or, do you? Or anything else, no. Are they too okay. big? Are those so, bits no, too big? That's, that's fine, darling. Ooh, you're, no, way no, you're way nicer. You're way nicer. Oh, there's all those seeds. <laughs> Things are heating up here in this kitchen. You're way nicer than, to Mar uh, you're way nicer to me than Mark is. Okay. Well, so we don't need, touch. We need to wash our hands. Yes. I'm following the rules. These dumplings are smelling incredible. And see how fast it was. And if you want to find out more information, you can find Dumpling NZ on Facebook or Instagram for these beauties. Right now, Annabelle and I are making dumplings. Yes. Well, we're assembling dumplings, really, because somebody else has beautifully handmade these dumplings. Exactly, with all the lovely goodness mm. in there, which is fantastic. Fantastic, all that lovely free range and local and vegetables from Levin, isn't it? It's, I mean, extraordinary yep. stuff. It's all a great free story. range. The veggies are from Levin, made with love, and of course, yeah. going to taste good in my tummy. Okay, so darling, throw the bok choy in there. Yes, yes. There's only so much excitement. Did I cut it all right you, for you? No, it was a bit rubbish fine, in the cutting. Truly, honestly. Okay, rustic, we like to call that. Rustic. Yeah. Now, just get ready, get mm -hmm. ready, because well, as soon as it starts to wilt, yes. you, you know, people talk about texture and things like that. It's quite a good thing to have it just have a little bit of texture still there, okay. actually. So you want a little bite. A little bit. Little and bite. then what we're doing here is just getting a little bit of coriander. Oh, yes. Now I'm double laying it. I'm going to throw that in there for yep. flavour. Then yep. I'm going to get a little bit ready for garnish because coriander is lovely. It does polarise people, so it's best to ask people, you know, beforehand if they like it or not. But are you quite happy with that? I love coriander. Well, guess Jesse what? Aberista hates coriander. He's really? Like, yeah, it's in his blood. Just can't eat it. Can't eat it. Well, are you quite happy? Isn't it looking good? It's looking fantastic. And can I just say, smelling fantastic oh, I know. as well. And how fast is this? And this I'm is dinner I like. Exactly. You, know, you can use, of course, the, with the little doodah that they've given you in the packet, you could put a bit of soy sauce in there if you wanted to to flavour it, but right. I'm taking it up a notch. And I've got two here. We've got chilli oil yes. and we've got mum's sauce. Now, this is a little bit avant-garde. I don't think Vicky will mind, but I'm going to add a oh, little okay. bit of this. Well, you're chefifying a recipe, oh, aren't no, you? No, I'm just... It's delicious, this stuff. Even if you've got poached chicken oh, left good. over, you can throw this over poached chicken. And the great thing about this mm. is you've got the dumplings in the freezer. You can, If you came home from work and you're feeling really hungry, yeah. you could just steam them or you can make this luscious meal. I mean, you could add all sorts of things to that. Are you going to put chilli in there well, too? Oh, I don't know. How much, <laughs> how much excitement can you take? Well, this is the beauty of food, Annabelle, well, isn't it? You just you just tried things <laughs> Well, that was interesting. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe a bit more of that. <laughs> The thing it's is, though, be the great thing with the dumplings is that because Vicky has done all that work for you and they you know you're good, you can't really go too far wrong because you're just putting in the broth. That's actually low. It's a low-fat meal. Great. And it's delicious. That. Okay, so, now, now these, look, these, of course, um, will be showcased at the food festival. The ASB showgrounds is where the food festival is coming up. The food up. show, yes. The food show, yes. Yep, I know, it is a festival in, in the heart. Festival with you but, there. But, darling, are you going to take that long to ladle that no, in there? No, no, do you no, want me on. to do that? Honestly, truly. <laughs> hold on. Now listen, I just want to show you this beautiful Mud Australia bowl. Look, hold that there, darling. Let yes. me get close to you. I know, what am uh, I doing, come Annabelle? On, hold the bowl, sweetheart. Oh, okay, you want the whole oh, shot. Hold the bowl and stroke it. And look, Angelina Jolie loves this. I mean, look at this beautiful water bottle. You can oh. throw that on the table. I just love this. I know, this mud gear is know, beautiful, isn't it? it's beautiful. It? So Mud Australia, here we are. They're at the show. Now yep. the thing about the show is that you can just go around oh, hang and on, you can right. chat to people at the show. You can meet Vicky. You can talk to the people who are bringing in this from Mud Australia. You've got this lovely sense of community and you can find out all about things that you normally would not necessarily be able yeah. to ask even on the old website and look food is changing oh. so fast at the moment and the food show is a great way to catch up with oh. new trends and old traditions that have come into the year 2018 you know it's oh it's one of those events that you and i could go around together oh. we could be a little we could be like a royal couple and who doesn't around. like food i mean, I mean we all need doesn't? it now sweetheart i'm just going to tip this over okay, Careful, cool. just keep away from there although they are heat resistant to these bowls they can actually go into the oven i mean how cool is that she's so nice to hang on to these bowls too, even Ooh. nicer with food in them. Oh, I think you're more attached to the bowl than you are to me, sweetheart. <laughs> I think that's the nature of our relationship. Now, we'll move this away. Oh, I think Angelina that. won't mind. Now, look at that gorgeous bowl, oh. and you throw the coriander. Now, that's 
that's mine. <laughs> maybe maybe that's I could just give you a little oh, bit. Is that my bowl? Is that... This is yours, Mike. A story of my life, and Annabelle. A bit, and a little bit more, you know, chilli sauce. Yeah, spice but it up. I just want to show this to you, that if you could do that, I mean, how amazing is that? And you show that to your friends, they're going to think that you've suddenly become this amazing mm. chef. And it's a kind of a cheat's guide to cooking because all the work's been done by Vicky and her team at the House of House of Dumplings. And you know it's good for you. That's the thing. You oh, know where everything's yes. coming from. You know it's made with love and it, it is. is smelling incredible. ASB Showgrounds for the food show. And if you want tickets, make sure you get them ASAP. Or, of course, you can just go and get them at the gate. Thank you, Annabelle. Oh, we'll talk my... to you more soon. OK, you okay, bet. Get the spoons ready, because right. I'll be into that. <laughs> and speaking of cute, Annabelle. Oh. This looks amazing. I know. It is just so delicious. Those wontons are yum. And that broth was so easy. I mean, honestly, we just literally threw things in a pot. I know. Mel, you did good. <laughs> you yeah. impressed? I know. So impressed. Well, how about this? Mel, would you like that for your oh. <laughs> you know, you're you're you know me quite well, don't you? <laughs> and maybe chilli oil for Mike, and maybe some of the mum's sauce for you. But that is just so yummy. And aren't those bowls beautiful? They are. So Mud oh, Australia, yeah. available now in New Zealand. Brilliant porcelain, can go anywhere, and very sexy. They... Oh, <laughs> yes, yes, indeed. They really are. Now, they're beautiful bowls, and they're, like they're at the food show, and that's the good thing about the food show, which is so exciting, mm. coming up this week. You've got a chance to meet people like this. Meet Vicky from the Dumplings. Oh, yeah. Yes. You know, it's all go. And uh, you're all go tomorrow. What are you doing tomorrow? Oh, tomorrow, fresh as easy panna cotta. Mm. Delicious. Oh, yeah, that sounds good. You'll take a trundle bag too to the food show. I'm really looking forward to that panna cotta.